this book is called The Shy Zebra and it's by Philip Gwynn and Penelope Prattley and it's all about a zebra who is shy. And it's a really interesting book. And so we turn to the first page and it says The Shy Zebra, the title of the book. And this little sign in this picture says Talent Show Today. So let's see what this is all about. The talent show is on today. Zebra has been practicing hard all week. Zebra has been singing and dancing and juggling. There's Zebra juggling some balls, doing some dancing and singing beautifully. Zebra has been practicing all week for the talent show. The show begins. First up is Cockatoo, yells Elephant. Cockatoo puts on an aerobatic show. Look at a cockatoo walking across the wire. Cockatoo does a roll, a tailspin, a loop the loop, and the animals in the audience clap loudly, and Zebra feels shy. Next up is Penguin, booms the elephant. Penguin puts on a gymnastic show. She does a bridge, a cartwheel, and a backflip. Very talented. And the animals in the audience cheer loudly. And Zebra, look at Zebra, feels even shyer. Next up is Rhino, rumbles elephant. Rhino puts on a music show. Look at that, playing a tuba. Rhino plays low sounds, bold sounds, and slow sounds. Beautifully playing the tuba. And the animals in the audience clap and cheer loudly. Look at all the animals cheering. They're all so excited to hear Rhino play the tuba. What a racket. The zebra's there looking very shy. Next up is Zebra, Bellows Elephant. Everyone look, looks around. Where is Zebra? Nowhere to be found. I will find him, says Cockatoo, and off he flies. Everyone's looking for Zebra. I wonder why Zebra's gone missing. Zebra's shy. Zebra, squawks Cockatoo, are you here? But there is no reply. Zebra, squawks Cockatoo, are you here? But there is no reply. Zebra, squawks Cockatoo, are you here? But there is no reply. Looking in all these different places where Zebra might be, can't be found. Zebra, squawks Cockatoo, are you here? No reply. Oh, hang on. Looks like we've got some uh, little zebra hoofs down here. Cockatoo is clever. He comes up with a plan. Zebra is hiding behind the curtain because Zebra is shy. So Cockatoo's plan is going to action. Zebra, says Cockatoo, you are an amazing singer. Zebra, you are an awesome dancer, says Cockatoo. Zebra, you are an incredible juggler, says Cockatoo. I wonder if this will work. There you are, Zebra, coming out from behind the curtain. Zebra says, Cockatoo says, why did you run away when you've been practicing so hard? I feel shy, says Zebra, in a little voice. I don't want everyone looking at me. That's okay. I will tell them that you are not performing, says Cockatoo. And Cockatoo flies away. Zebra thinks how sad everyone will be if he doesn't perform, said Elephant, said Penguin, and said Rhino. But they are my friends, Zebra thinks. Cockatoo, wait for me. Next up is Zebra, trumpets elephant. And Zebra sings, Zebra dances, 
Zebra juggles and juggles and juggles. Look at Zebra performing and everyone really happy and clapping loudly. So here's some questions coming from this book. Why did Zebra feel shy, do you think? Have you ever felt shy? How did Zebra behave when he felt shy? What do you do when you feel shy? How did Cockatoo help Zebra overcome his shyness? And what helps you to feel a little bit less shy? How can you help others when they feel shy? And how happy was everyone when Zebra performed? What a beautiful book, The Shy Zebra. And the lesson is, let's overcome our shyness and participate fully in the activities that are going on so everyone can have fun together.